ladies and gentlemen. Good evening, I'm Good Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas, Atlas and we welcome you to the New Orleans State Palace Theater for our main event of the evening. 10 rounds of heavyweights. This should be a good one tonight. Both fighters say they are primed, coming off a very intense and passionate training camp. And his opponent across the ring, fighting out of Louisville, the greatest of all time. Rules in the dressing room. Let's have a good clean fight. Touch them up. Well, they're scheduled to spend a half an hour swapping leather. This is a 10-rounder. Muhammad Ali's scouting report is an easy one to read. Three letters. J-A-B. Yes, sir. And that's exactly what he's doing. He's jabbing in his way. And I don't mean talking. Yeah, I mean throwing that stiff lead hand out into his opponent's face all night long. That's great stuff. He fires one right back after taking one. Gotta love the work by Muhammad Ali. A well-targeted classic one-two by Muhammad Ali. And Tyson with a block punch. Scored well with that straight left. Power puncher versus the ultimate power puncher. How's it gonna go? Well, when you have more than power, it goes your way. Tyson has speed, he has a good style, he has an ability to be elusive. The other guy only has power, it's gonna go Tyson's way. He has too many weapons. Good smooth work by Mike Tyson. That's classic counter punching. Yeah, what he did was he pulled that right shoulder back. You know, he just pulled it back, gave him the left shoulder, and then gave him the right hand. Mike Tyson's combination punching working out well there. He landed three solid shots. Solid straight right hand. Little volume punching to the body there. Good defense, just covering up down low. There's a straight right hand. Tried to land that upstairs and was off the mark. And now that backhand, the straight left hand, scores well for him. Two good jabs by Mike Tyson. A little give and take, and here comes the left hand. This round comes to an end here. Joe Tessitore sitting ringside as always with Teddy Atlas. Love coming to this fight venue. We always have a great time when we come to town, with the exception of having to pay the bill for our entire crew on the night before when they take us out to a steak dinner. Yeah, you know, they remind me of fighters a little bit. You know, the fighters that we see that have very, you know, every once in a while, very short arms. <laughs> <laughs> you know? They these, do! <laughs> they, these guys were They don't real. have the reach. No, they, they don't. They can't reach for the wall. No, they don't. And I tell you, they would be great on the inside. Really great. I wish I could put them on the inside in the kitchen where I didn't have to take care of them at the table, but great guys. Targeting that belt line with the right hand. Took a shot, now he gives a left. Tyson's giving us something to think about early on in this fight here, but his opponent has even more to think about. He has established the jab already. Yes, he has established the jab, and now his opponent has to think about moving his head so he can get Keep past it. Nice combination by Mike Tyson. by that. Big shot there. Muhammad Ali goes down. Ali is down and his opponent put him there with a precision, perfectly placed power punch.